A dramatic glimpse into life with the royal family has been offered by former aide Dick the Arbiter, which could also help explain why Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have lost so many senior staff over recent months. Dickie Arbiter, who worked with the Queen for 12 years, spent five years largely assisting Prince Charles and Princess Diana. According to Global News he warned royal aides risk suffering from burnout. Since last November three of Meghan and Harry's closest aides have left. Mr Arbiter said, I was one of the Queen's press secretaries with the remit. In addition to answering to her, 90% of my time was spent looking after the Prince of Wales and Princess Diana. I'd been on the job with them for five years. Any longer and I would have been burnt out. In November Melissa Twabty, a personal assistant to Meghan, quit after only six months on the job. The next month Samantha Cohen, private secretary to the Duke and Duchess, resigned from her position. Meanwhile Amy Picarillo, another close aide to Meghan, is expected to leave her employment shortly. Ms. Pickerel has agreed to stay with the couple until Meghan gives birth, expected to be during this spring, but will depart soon afterwards. Speaking to People.com a source described the split as very amicable and said Ms. Pickerel would continue to offer the Duchess informal advice. However Mr. Arbiter emphasized the departure of several key staff is not a matter of concern. He commented, by outward appearances, it has been a bit of a revolving door. But it just so happens with the Cambridge and Sussex households that employees started around the same time. Last summer Edward Lane Fox announced his retirement as Prince Harry's private secretary. He had been in the position for a total of five years.